love bugs is rosalind back at you one more again i hope everybody is doing blessed i'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you and if this is your first time stopping by my channel much love to you and welcome and to my returning subs my grown extended beautiful family just thank you thank you for taking the time out and supporting me on my videos you know letting me know that you can totally relate resonate with the things that I'm going through it's amazing that we all have our different situations that you know we struggle with we're trying to let go of things but we're all connecting in the same way you know we might have different things that's going on in our lives but we're all resonating pretty much on the same level so with that being said it's very blessed to be able to do that to know that i'm not the only one going through these things so with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you have uh, been watching my videos for a while and have not already please like and subscribe even hit that notification bell so you know when your girl's about to upload her next video also excuse me if you are comfortable enough, please drop me a line or two. I would love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video, or you're just up, tell me about your impact, the gift, and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction. Also, if you feel like the video has been very informative to you or just gave you some good vibes you would love to share with a family friend, or even a fellow empath that's really going through some things right now that you know that you can see that connects with us in that way please go ahead and do so and while you're at it give me a thumbs up like and also share on the social media favorites wherever you see fit and thank you once again for stopping by my channel and giving me so much love and support i really make me humble and make me feel blessed as well so uh and i hope you're able to resonate with the content of my video and today my um my my music that i'm listening to my meditation music uh is called 432 hertz a positive energy hang drum music meditation healing and stress relief um uh, and yoga and i'll post that link in the description box below it i like that beat that they got in the background uh oh i guess my batteries don't went out <laughs> but anyways uh I had to push Scooby back up there. Um, my video today is about Twin Flame 101. Hey, Oka's, uh, hey, Oka's finding your, your, your new life purpose. You know, all of us go through some really jacked up crazy things in life where is, uh, where we can be on one level, you know, doing our normal jobs, doing a nine to five, taking care of our children, doing little household chores and stuff like that. And it's just something that always pops up into our lives that really shake things up. And it's just like some of us at times, you know, are lost when we don't know our purpose. And it's just like your, your enlightenment or your spiritual awakening, ascension, kundalini, dark night of the soul, it all have to make you go to rock bottom just for you to come back, for you to be able to know what your true purpose is you know you you can feel like your one purpose is one thing and it totally shifts you over into a different direction and that's a true blessing even though it, it takes some hard times to really go through or whatever but i know we all got to go through these certain situations for a reason and it's um it's a blessing to be able to go through that and just be able to say you know what you know, you can look at the things that you have gone through you know because there's times i look at myself and just be like uh, oh gosh, you know, I hate going through the things that I'm going through, but you know, I know this is, you know, happening for a reason. It has to be. And, um, it has to be going through a reason. Like I told y'all when I first started, you know, I know there's a lot of people, I probably said this before, but there's some new people that are, are just subscribed and welcome to the family. Um, that, you know, when I first started, it was just about me finding out who my father was, which was really a shock to me. Even though I knew we were always connected, I never knew why we were connected. He was always that mystery, mystery man, you know, and then being able to finally find out things, it took him to have to pass away for me to be able to get that knowledge I was supposed to have a long time ago but everything happens for a reason but starting my videos it was just like me trying to reconnect with my biological family know my father's side as well as my you know finding my my biological mom and finding out all of a sudden I'm like what's a twin flame and then you know starting to see the meaning of it and I really freaked out you know knowing that 
two soul, you know, one soul can be split up into two bodies. And just knowing all these things, I had to really go through rock bottom, you know, finding out who my dad was, finding out that my family knew this whole time and, you know, kept that away from me. And then all of a sudden being able to open up to the world, telling my life story, being able to help other people. And I really didn't know my purpose in life. All I knew is that, you know, I wanted to be able to help people. I just didn't know how I was going to be able to do it. I've been wanting to do that since I was a little girl. And basically being able to open up and tell the world about the things that I'm going through, things that I'm healing from, you know, it, it's an everyday process. You know, nobody can't get over something like that. That's tragic, you know, losing your dad and you know trying to find out your mom and then you find out the truth that you know your mom your adopted my mom my adopted mom wanted me to know but my my adopted father didn't so you know knowing all these things that was a lot for me to have to heal from but it's just the blessings that i can see throughout that tragedy being able to say i'm a humble person to know i'm blessed in all aspects of life all levels and seeing my my true purpose on helping other empaths, you know, that has all these different, you know, uh, multi gifts, uh, being able to help them know that, you know, we can be tragic, can, tragic situations can be thrown at us left and right. And yes, it might take a while to be able to go through things like that. We lose our loved ones. We lose our best friends. We, we lose our jobs. We get divorced, you know, <laughs> going through all these different things. Um, but it takes a healing process but with us being hayokas and you know just different kind of empaths light workers or whatever where we get thrown in the lines then to go <laughs> deal with whatever we got to deal with even though it can be a tragic situation but being able to heal from that knowing this is this situation has brought me to my life purpose and i'm just like wow we have to go through so many hard things to be able to find out what we are but i guess it's just the fact is that's the only way they can shake us up and get our attention because it's just like hey they can't tap on your shoulder and say hey you know you know you know you're a twin flame or hey you know you're an empath it takes you to have to go through some really jacked up situations for you to be able to know and it's just like you know, me watching YouTube videos and then, you know, seeing on Facebook as well as YouTube, all these different motivational speakers and just, you know, and then I'm like, ta-ting, hey, this is something I want to do. I really love how they, you know, they present themselves, but I was so terrified of getting in front of the camera. Like, what do I say? You know, because when I first started my videos, I was really, really quiet and, you know, knowing I'm a loud person, but it's a whole different story when you're in front of a camera. So it is just like being able to look at how how far I came, you know, when you first start your journey, you're going to be a totally different person when you go towards the end of it. And it's just like, even though I had hard times, I love the, 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 you know, the finishing process of the whole situation, being able to help people, be able to know you're not the only one going through this. You know, we got each other's backs. We're all, you know, we're all over the world. You know, it's a blessing when I can find people or know people or even meet people from Russia, from Germany, Japan, New Zealand, uh, Africa, you know, Iraq, you know, and it, it's just a beautiful thing. We all come from different walks of life, but we're all brothers and sisters, you know, no matter what nationality you are, what color you are, you know, we're all one. You know, we, we just connect in oneness and it's a beautiful thing where you can actually come into a community and not be judged. You know, because it's just like when it's already bad in the world, we always have the segregation. Like you can't go to an airport and somebody from India or, I, you know, Iraq or Pakistan or Egypt can walk in without you already profiling them or anybody that, you know, could be Caucasian or, you know, German or whatever and you're thinking something else you know it's just sad when you can go places like that and you're already judged just by the color of your skin or your religion and stuff like that but when you come into this community I don't see none of these things I just see a brother or a sister that are just on different parts of the world that we're all coming together 
in a beautiful place to say, you know what, hey, I'm going through this, or hey, you've helped me, or hey, I'm glad I'm not the only one, or oh gosh, you know, this is what this label is, this is what I am. You know, it's a beautiful thing to be able to find your life purpose, knowing you had to go through so much hell to be able to find out this is what I had to go through. And that's how people usually find out the things that they want to do. They have the failures, they have the setbacks, they have the mistakes. Um, we have our weak points. We have the points that sometimes we want to give up, but it's just the things that we know we really want in life. It won't allow us to do that. Cause even when you get frustrated and say, like, Oh, bump it. I'm ready to give up. I'm done. I for forget this. And then next thing you know, you know, you get frustrated and it has that guardian angel that's telling you, Hey, you know, it's okay to fail or it's okay to have a setback or it's okay to have a day of rest. But get back on it later, you know, get come back to it, you know, just take your time out, you know, and that's a true blessing to be able to do. And knowing, you know, there's there's been days where, you know, I ask God crying, you know, why did I have to go through this? Why? I mean, this is so hard, you know, going through different days and not feeling like I want to get out the bed in the morning, not not even want to live, um, not feeling that pain anymore. That suffering because there's not too many you know there's some people out there that didn't feel like they were gonna make it and gave up on life which is truly sad we have us out there that's like that but then we have these soldiers that you know even though that we went through so many things and took so many losses we're still able to get up the next day trying to find answers to why we had to go through what we had to go through why did we have to lose the people we lost and still keep on going on and being here while they were denied that you know it is it's, it's a hard thing to go through but you know all of us have serve our purpose in life you know some of us are doing it on a different plane in the spiritual plane and some of us are still here on this plane doing the serving our purpose here but being able to know that you're finding your true purpose being able to go through hell and back so many times where we got frequent fire miles there for our tragedies to know that we we're gonna we, we were built for this and it's sad that we have to go through all these crazy sacrifices just to become what we truly are you know everything has a lesson everything is connected in some kind of way we meet people we lose people we gain people and it's just a blessing to be able to have all these different experiences and being able to live to tell that so you know when you're finding your true purpose knowing that you might have to hit rock bottom but after you hit rock bottom there's no other place to go but up so knowing that you're going through this you're going through it for a reason you have a story to tell and you know coming through all these going through all these tragedies can make you come out a lot stronger and a lot wiser so i hope you are able to you know resonate with the content of my video i'm gonna go ahead and have a couple more videos just come out probably do about two or three today and then you know start back up later on today or within the next day so and i'll see you on my next video uh like and subscribe even hit that notification bell i hope you're able to resonate um Hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And know that you are truly blessed, highly favored, and forever loved. And knowing there's always someone out there praying for your better days. I'm going to give my shout out to Alana Fox Starks. Much love to you. Welcome to the family. Let me see. She was like on my first new page. So I'm trying to get back to my other pages. Um, oh, okay, Janelle. Uh, and learning to love with Laura or and that'll be it